me start by saying, so is this, listen, obviously I loved your guys' chemistry in Ragnarok. You have fantastic chemistry in this. Is this the beginning of you guys doing like a Bogart Bacall kind of thing? <laughs> we talked, yeah, we talked about it. That was certainly a reference point for me. I thought of all those greats, Bacall, Bogart, uh, Hepburn, Tracy, you know. It, they, we used to do that. You used to be able to see uh, actors for decades, you know, mm -hmm. join each other. It's fun to see someone through the breadth of their career work with someone else and, and stretch in those ways. So I wouldn't be mad at it. I wouldn't be mad at it. Um, is that something though? Like you were on the set of this, are you already thinking? Looking at these scripts, do you know what I mean? Like, is it so, if that makes any sense? If what's the question? I guess what I'm saying is, have you already looked at other things, or is it something if it magically comes together? All to, for us to do. Yeah. yeah. Oh, well, look, it, it, you the, immediately when you're reading a script, you oh, that, that, this, this person can do that. I don't know. What is this yeah. person has to do this or that? And having worked together before and just being great friends makes the whole process easy. I think the more you work, you kind of you really appreciate the ones that are fun and really kind of loathe the experiences that aren't and that has to do with the people, you know, and you, and, and, and you have four months in each other's space and, you know, the kind of, that it's, it's such a sort of small little tight unit, you know, and um, you want to be with people you appreciate and appreciate you and there's a trust and a respect and so, uh, yeah, it, it, um, there's a couple of things yeah. where I'm looking at and thinking, oh, somebody, Tessa. <laughs> uh, I've heard, a lot of actors I've spoken to have like a pre-shooting ritual. Some people love music, some people love silence, whatever it may be. How do each of you work? And is it something that is like super compatible or are you more unique? Well, uh, I don't have a pre-ritual. I mean, You have one ritual, but I'm not gonna say what it is, but I, it's a ritual I've adopted. Oh, thanks. Really? I mm -hmm. kind of want to know what it is, but now I'm scared. That I'll it's tell you later. Offensive. Okay, okay. <laughs> right. Um, I, I, we, we we have different approaches, I think, but similar approaches. We've kind of I, I mean, we've melded our approaches, haven't we? Yeah, we have. Yeah, we've we've, we've learned from each other. I kind of um, I, I I like to it to sort of scare the hell out of me, you know. And improv sort of is intimidating, but I can't, it becomes an addictive sort of adrenaline, and, and I, I, I I kind of love it, you know. And um, but it needs to be reined in from time to time. He likes to go off the rails, like b beyond like anything that matters yeah. <laughs> in terms of the story. In terms of the story, and that is like myself. a new that's a new thing for for me. But I, it's good. Now you occasionally come with me off the rails. I come and, with and you, and then, and then sometimes I bring you back, back and, and it's yeah. a whole thing. It's a dance. I understand. As it should be. I have a few random questions, uh, which I'm going to try to work in really quick. Do you have, do you remember your first movie or TV show crush? Um, Robin, Robin Wright in um, uh, Princess Bride. Oh, yeah. I liked Uncle, Uncle Jesse on Full House. Oh, <laughs> John yeah. Yeah. Um Also, and this was hard for me on Ragnarok, one of my earliest crushes is Jeff Goldblum. Wow. So that was, I was, that yeah. was, that still is, that's. Yeah. <laughs> you can't go wrong. I think it's my last thing. Um, what TV show would you love to guest star on? Um, Fleabag. Peaky Blinders. Right. Yeah. Both quality entertainment. Thank you so much for your time. Thank you. Uh, enjoy the afternoon. Thank you. Nice to see you both.